Alright, hello and welcome back everybody to Hexen 2, uh, the Portal Previous Expansion. So yeah, here we are, we are in the Ice Caverns, it's been uh, a week since we were here previously. I've not had time to record or anything. But yeah, now we're gonna progress. And if you remember, we had to go into a room and there was a, some kind of altar. And we had to place a certain object. Seldut, I guess it was called. Yeah, we gotta find that thing, and I'm quite sure right now where we need to look. So let's get going. The first thing I want to do here is just step on this here thing, which opens up a secret passage. Voila! Actually, not a secret passage per se, but we get a tome of power. I mean, tomes of power are awesome. So yeah, that's always sweet. Next, we need to find another place. That's not the right way. It's quite of a maze this area, but it's not too bad. If it would be a maze, I would be quite lost most of the time because I'm very bad at navigating them. Yeah, listen to the team, it's very nice. Yeah, so something which I didn't realize previously is that up here on the beer tables, keep following the beer tables, there's this huge chandelier and we just have to break the, the wire or the chains or whatever and now we can fall down here. And here is a skeleton dude. And there is a gem just floating around. You possess the stone of Seldut. And obviously, this is Seldut. Pretty tough luck, and now you're even desecrated. Ooh, a breastplate. I do like the armor. Armor makes me glad. There's one of these Seal of the Ovinomancer. And a Glyph of the Ancients. I'm pretty sure that. That previous item was called something else uh, in the vanilla game, but I'm not sure. Something to do with... Uh, well, I don't even remember. But the thing which turn or morphs enemies into, into sheep, I guess. Yeah, well let's get going here. I'm quite low on mana as well. So, um, I'm actually gonna do this. I usually like to save these. But I'm smelling a bad situation here, so we need to have plenty of mana to deal with any potential enemies. And that's the wrong area, we need to make our way back to the altar region. And perhaps it was downstairs, I'm not sure. Well, actually I'm sure, it's over here. I must not doubt myself. Yeah, Here we are, in the Tibet Tibetan uh, region does have some uh, eastern influences, this temple does, yeah, so this is the right area. Just place the gem here, what magic happened, there's flames, and the gem just disappeared, I mean we don't get to keep it or anything, but yeah, as you saw there, and now we can finally proceed uh, with the level. We can go to that strange ice area which our weapons couldn't touch. That's very nice. I should also save the game soon enough here. I mean, you don't want to die when you've made a bunch of progress. Yeah, we need to go here. I don't want to go to that other area again. So yeah, we are outside. Let's actually go ahead here and make a save. Because who knows what will happen as we go through that door. Yeah, yoink, some healing vials. This thing is still closed. It's closed to the public, no entrance. Some creaky doors. Can you hear that? If I ever heard an ominous noise, that's one you should look out for. There's gotta be some bad guys down here. They even provided an arena for us. Oh, there we go. Are you kidding me? Play were shattered by Yakiman. Yeah, so there you go. We had a very good reason to save. I smelled trouble and it was it was coming. So yeah, now how do we deal with this guy? I'm not sure, maybe I'll just use my spare imp dude. I mean he could use some uh, fresh air. Yeah, there you go. Go at it. Yay, where'd you go in? Come on. You're the man. Whoa. 
Run away. Way to go, Imp. Ah, now I know what I did wrong here. Oh, the Imps is still alive. That's cool. But yeah, I really need to use one of my Tomes of Power. I feel very weak here. Of course, don't let him hit you with that thing. Oh, there's a bigger space up over here. I'm fairly sure that's gonna be some kind of freezing ray. Ooh, damn. Yeah, you blow blew into pieces. Sweet. What about your buddy here? Is he dead? Yay, he's dead. We had to use a bunch of very, very good items here, of course. Yeah. It doesn't matter. As long as you get through here. Ooh, looking nice. Let's go ahead and make another save here. Who knows what lurks behind the corner. Eek. I do like the command mana. What about this thing here? It's a cat book. Let's break it. Yeah, I guess we can't. How boring. Yeah, it's much calmer right now. Almost as if something is about to happen yet again. The culmination of the level in some kind of horrible event. And that's one big green mana here. Alright, gave us 30. That's good. There's a key. You possess Tien's key. And there's always Tien. And what else is there to do than to put him out of his misery? Well, there's steam coming out of some pipes here. It's a bit strange. And I bet this is the door which was jammed or shut down. Not quite sure. Can you hear that, guys? Some more enemies behind the corner somewhere. Whoa. This is one of those situations, let's just save. There's a blade. They have acquired the dagger of Ajanti. Yeah, I knew something was about to happen. Holy crap, I'm very weak. Actually here, let's just run. Kick it. We don't really need to fight these guys. I mean, 57 hit points. Hope they don't follow me. Maybe they do. Actually, we could maybe duke it out with them. But then again, it's really not worth the trouble. At most, they would like drop a soul or two. But yeah. We would waste a ton of mana killing those guys. And we already killed a few of their buddies earlier. So yeah. Alright, so Dagger of Ajanti and Tien's Key. That's pretty cool. So, we need to get back. Because if you remember, when we uh, go to this place, or one of the earlier levels, we faced a door and a temple, and it was locked, and they spoke about the Dagger of Ajanti. Hmm. And then, maybe again, I'm a fool. Come on, I need to go back there. I'm quite sure. We can't really go back. I should have realized that we can't go back anymore. Or can we? Let's try. That was where we had to go, and this was the first area. Press this thing down. Can we actually proceed now? Ah, Tien's key has not outlived its usefulness. So yeah, that was good. That was the right thing to do. Come on, dude, please jump out of the water. We don't want to use no clip yet again. Alright, so we're back in what place is this? Tulku. Alright, nice. Tulku. So yeah, this should be the area somewhere here. Or not this area per se. Whoa. What am I doing? Oh, that was the elevator. I just got scared right there. I forgot that it was an elevator. Yeah, there's nothing up here, so we could just jump down. Hope we don't lose any health. Yeah. The soundtrack here was really awesome. 
That's good, we didn't even have to deal with those guys, those Minotaurs. It would have been a pain. Anything else up here? Anything has changed? Nope. Oh, I didn't kill all those slimy buggers. They're still sliming it up over there. I don't want to deal with those guys. Let's just go back here, and this should be the place. Place the dagger in the stone, the sword in the stone. Now we can move on to our next destination, which is the false temple. Ooh, ominous. I wonder if there's a level change, and it is. Oh, let's hide behind the corner. Could be some bad guys over there. And yeah, that's just the way back. Yeah. And we know that leads to Tulku. So yeah, I'm just gonna um, stop it here for the day, and when we continue in the next part, we're gonna go over there, we're gonna kick some ass with those horse shackers over there, patrolling, doing uh, oh, some stuff. Now we could pick up that as well, but it's gonna be all in the next episode, so I'll see you guys, as always, next time.